So guys, Kanye's wife, Bianca Sensori West, has everyone buzzing about her. And when I tell you buzzing, buzzing nonstop. And not just that, she has everyone doing the landing strip look like, what's up with that? We saw Kim doing it, and I didn't even realize that Chloe also did a similar look. And we're seeing these look looks popping up here and there. And listen, everyone is getting on board. Remember, as we said that, once he does something, no matter how taboo or unorthodox it may seem, people normally copies, replicate, and such delight. And now we're seeing it with Kim and her family, plus other creators are very intrigued by this, right? Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with starting a trend. Ain't nothing wrong with people copying something. But you know what is wrong? When people copy and pretend as if they'll are, they are the ones who originally started it. People like Kim and her family. That's when people see something wrong with copying. But let's talk about what The Sun is reporting about Ye's wife. Because you guys know, once there's something trending, you can bet your ass, I'll be updating you on that. Now, The Sun is saying, Exhibit DD, Bra Free, Bianca Sensori, wants to look sexy and show her body. She makes an effort to look unprepared. Expert says, listen, this girl is just so hot. I mean, I guess that is what you all are obsessed about. But let's talk about what the son is saying, their experts are saying about his wife. Because there's always an expert weighing in on this woman. She's such a mystery. <laughs> but let's talk about it. Now, the son is saying that. Bianca Sensori brawless excursion along with Ye in Hollywood sidewalk have become more frequent since of late. Um, if you remember the photograph, which I'm going to include, they're saying that it's frequent. But it's the summer. It's hot. I mean, yeah, she made it look damn good. But a lot of brawless women are out and about the summer. Do you realize? I mean, this person has to be a man because do you realize how hard it is to wear a bra it doesn't matter your size it's really hard and especially when it's hot just imagine the girls with larger bus areas it's really really a task but let's continue they're saying that you no know, a fashion psychologist has suggested that the 28 year old the 28 year old bus boosting walk with kanye west are a setup with her aim being to show off everything but i mean she has been showing off everything it's nothing new come on what are you guys indicating or is it that you guys want to you know stir the pot a bit it's given the sense that they want to stir the pot a bit now the sun is saying that on may 13th bianca sensori was photographed out in west Hollywood shopping with her husband, Kanye West 45. The Aussie Yeezy designer looked curvy on the sidewalk wearing what appeared to be a gym outfit. The former student architect 28 sported a deep gray legging and a white bra top pulled tightly across her boobs. But her decision to add kitten heels raised our expert's eyebrow. I mean, kitten heels is the way to go, honey. I love a good pair of kitten heels. You know what? They give you that sense of elegance, even with the simplest look. And that is what I love it for. It's not, you know, a pain on the eel, not a pain on your foot. It's just cute, simple, effortless, and classy. Now, let's continue with what, you know, the sun expert is saying. They're saying giving her a sloppy looking outfit and messy crop hair, passerby might have assumed makeup free. Bianca wasn't bothered by how she looked. I knew she was makeup free. Um, the Daily Mail is saying that she was wearing subtle makeup. And I'm saying, heck no, this woman is more than 90% of the times makeup free. Listen, that's a flex that many girls wish they could do, but they can't. The popular, famous billionaire girl. Our girl, Kimmy Cakes, wish she could do this makeup-free flex. But not even when Kim was younger, Kim used to do a makeup-free flex. Um, she used to be, well, she still is, always in makeup, right? But here is Ye's wife doing the makeup-free flex. But let's continue. Now, they're saying that um, her husband was decked out similarly in somber black legging and knee pads and loose 
loose sweatshirt, and bizarre looking sliders. Their excursion assumed a similar pattern in March when Bianca was shopping with Kanye alongside along sorry Melrose Place. Once again, it appeared as if she was dressed without a bra. In an exclusive interview, fashion psychologist Carolyn Mayer told the Sun, at first glance, Bianca looked as if she has not dressed up. Yeah, Carolyn always has something to say about Bianca. Do you guys realize Carol Carolyn Mayer is always zooming in to Bianca? She's always trying to analyze Bianca. I think this Carol um Carolyn Mayer might be, you know, intrigued by Bianca's beauty. I have to say because every time we see a report from the Sun that says psychologist or expert it is always carolyn mayor mark that name so next time you see a report you can say oh yeah star was right about carolyn <laughs> but let's continue they're saying that uh, carolyn is saying that at first glance bianca look as if she has not dressed up for the cameras i don't think she's ever dressed up for the cameras i think she's dressed up for herself how she feels you know about that the that day and how she wants to look for that particular day now um caroline is saying bianca looks unprepared but she knows she will be photographed everywhere she goes you do not wear a vest top like that even if you're going to the gym or shopping without being happy for her nipples to be showing really oh lord you should see the girls in the caribbean you would be stunned. They look like this every day and they know that no paparazzi is going after them because the time is hot and no one wants to wear a bra like, Caroline, do you have boobs? Do you understand the struggles of wearing bra at this time of the year? Oh, please, girl. Let's continue. Caroline is saying that it also looks as if Bianca has tucked it up to show her um muscly abs and slim waist she might have pulled the top into a knot at the back to make it even tighter tucking it also gives the shadow underneath the breast in photos this accentuates the size of her breast and makes them look as if they are bigger the top is also white against the skin there's also very little support in the top which means she wants to show off her, bo her body as well her top is quite see-through so it's not just showing off her nipples you can see the shape of her boobs oh caroline you're going in like ease up I mean, you're just going into all these details about this woman. It's kind of giving you the side eye at the moment. So Carolyn is saying that her top is quite see-through, so it's not just showing her nipples. You can see the shape of her boobs. Bianca is a big busted lady, and she is showing off everything. But Carolyn has already spoken about that about two months ago. Why is she coming back to talk about Bianca's boobs all over again? Now, Miss Carolyn, who? Miss Carolyn is saying that despite keeping a low profile on social media in January, Bianca cooked up a storm online images of her new sharp. Okay, so I don't see where she's going with this. To be very honest, I I do understand that, you know, she's saying that Bianca looks effortless, but while Bianca looks effortless. Bianca has put some effort into this look. So to, you know, viewers, she it, it may seem as though she stepped out, you know, looking unintentional with this look. However, Bianca was definitely going for this look. She wanted to be seen. She wanted the size of the boobs to be seen. Bianca wanted to show off her body and hence why she had tied a knot in the back of the top that she's wearing right now um she's saying that bianca is um bianca continues to be pr um, promoting a unique and provocative look you would expect bianca to be wearing trainers with these leggings um mere added the leggings have seams down the front that draws the viewer's eye to the to bianca's feet they also have extended gusset going up the body in the front that draws attention to her private part so that looks sexual listen carolyn i think you're from a different planet because honestly the things that you're pointing out i mean it's making us want to give you the side eye because I don't think that everything that you're saying is what Bianca went for. Um, 
in terms of drawing people to certain areas of her body. I honestly believe that it is Bianca's sense of style. Looking at, you know, some of the photographs that we've come across of Bianca, the ones that we can show, this has always been Bianca before Ye. And I really don't think that she was out here, you know, getting people to look at her JJ area, getting people to look at her bust line. I don't think they were prepared for the paparazzi, to be quite honest. I know that she is aware that there is a chance she will be photographed if she goes out. But does this mean that every time she's going out, she needs to be um, thinking about the paparazzis or should she think about what she's most comfortable wearing how she wants to feel and look on that day. I believe that's what she was going for. I don't know what's going on with Miss Caroline, but Caroline, you're doing too much. It needs to stop. Every time Bianca comes out looking like this, looking sexy, expert Caroline has something to say. Well, guys, I want to hear from you. Let me know what your thoughts are about this, you know, expert Miss Caroline, you know, diving into and breaking down Bianca's look. Some part of it I've totally left out because what Caroline is implying is that the leggings that Bianca is wearing with that particular cut in the Vajaya area, she did that to draw sexual attraction to herself. But I mean, these leggings are so popular. We see so many brands making them and they're even coming up a bit thinner as time passes so whether it is to drive sex appeal or not it is what is going on it's not just bianca i understand with her being his wife there'll be a lot of focus on her people are gonna want to see what she's doing next and all of that jazz but do you think that the media is doing too much at this point in time when it comes to bianca's look i want to hear from you guys because this is really a no-no for me. This is going a bit too far, in my opinion, but I want to hear from you. While you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Sure, if you care, and see you all next time. Bye, guys.